Hi, my name is Sydney Marr, and I've designed this beautiful essential shawl for you. You can wear it very easily over the shoulders as I have it. Tie it easily around your waist, maybe tie it as a high shrug. You can wear it as a lovely wrap over your shoulders. You could also take it and do what I call the deep waterfall. Take it from the ends, tie it in a tiny little knot, and you just want a beautiful drape of fabric like this. Then there is, of course, the reverse. Take the ends, tie it here, so you have a very lovely look. You can wear it as a capelet. So you take the ends, you tie them in a tiny little knot, and you can make a beautiful capelet. And all of a sudden, you have a beautiful, short shawl. You can also take it over your shoulder, take the ends, you twist it, put it back over so that you have a beautiful drape in the front. So the essential shawl can also be worn as a long vest. So what you do is you take it, you flip it around, you tie the sleeves around the back of your neck, and you have a beautiful drapey vest. You wrap it around to make yourself a beautiful halter top. You can make it into a drape neckline. Place it on your front, tie it around your back neck, take the sides and tie it so that you have a beautiful drape neckline camisole. Cross it over, make one of those small knots that we spoke about, and you can get a little bit of a skirt front. So the beautiful essential shawl can also be worn backwards because it has a universal sleeve and a universal neckline. So you put it on, make it nice and drapey. It could be just like this, draped down the back. The way I love to wear it is to cross it over and tie it into what we call a reverse shark bite. Wear it draped in the neckline here, or if you prefer, you can wear it high and put your jewelry over top. If you take it and tie the small knot in the back, you can have a beautiful look, perhaps wear it with a wonderful belt, or just tie it in the back as I have it.